So in another video I had mentioned that I have vitiligo. Now if you don't know what vitiligo is, the link is in the description below to the video where I explained it. And it's also up right now. Now another thing that's going on is, well I also mentioned in another video that I have and you know, eye problems. Uh, I was born with bad vision, but I also have this problem with my peripheral vision. Now the thing is I can see, I'm looking at the corners of, you know, corners right now with my hands outstretched and I can see my hands. The thing is, at times, I my peripheral vision just becomes poor. And the thing is, like, well, let me give you an example. It's really hard to tell people, it's really hard to have them visualize what's going on. But let me give you an example. Uh, I might drop a pen and I might be looking for it and it would take me anywhere from like maybe 5, 10, maybe even 20 seconds to find it. And the funny thing is, when I'm looking down, I usually see just the ground. And lo and behold, 5, 10, whatever seconds later, it just magically appears where I was just scouring. So, I, I don't know why that happens. Um, I've heard that it might be due to retinal detachment, or glaucoma, or I, I'm not sure. But uh, I've been told by the optometrist that I don't really have a retinal detachment issue. So I don't know, I mean, I've had this for a while now. And the thing is, I might not see things when I'm walking around. I might run into, you know, uh, a fan or a wall or, well, hopefully not a wall, but, you know, just, or someone walking in my direction and I don't see them. And here's the irony, at nighttime, you know, if, if there's like really, really low dim lights, uh, I can see them better out of the corner of my eyes than when I'm looking at them directly. So that's really, really strange. And I'm really not sure why, why that happens either. Another good example is when I go to the optometrist and they have you look through that viewfinder where there's that one little white uh, dot in the middle and they tell you to just look at it and let them know when you see, you know, a few blinking dots around, you know, to test your peripheral vision. The thing is, I might spot like, three, four, five. The thing is, I have no clue how many of them flash, and sometimes I'm not even sure if that's just my imagination or not, so it's, you know, it's really, I don't know what's going on there. Now, I'm not sure how many of you have this problem as well, you know, if it's hard to describe to people because, I mean, it's only something you can visualize and it's really, really hard to explain to them. If so, you know, leave a comment or a video response below to, you know, just you know, explain, you know, let me know what's going on with you, because, I mean, it, it might be the same thing that's going on with me, but it's just really, really hard to tell people what's going on. So, yeah, I just thought I'd let you guys know about this. You know, just another little thing to know about me, uh, another kind of bad thing to know about me, but just another thing nonetheless. So, anyway, I will talk to you guys next time, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.